Round start. Fantastic! Unbelievable! Hello, everybody, and welcome back to some more Totally Not Minecraft. The Minecraft series survival hardcore challenge thing where I have to survive in Minecraft hardcore Hazen Cliffs update without the ability to use a pickaxe, which is a bit counterintuitive because it's, you know, it's it's the caves and cliffs update, and I'm not I'm not allowing myself to mine, so it's a, it's a bit counterintuitive. But it's also kind of fun and kind of challenging. I have this to show you, by the way. Yes, you know what this means. We finally got an armorer villager in the village, and I've been mass trading with this guy, and I've got way more armor than I know what to do with. So I'm actually going to. I know this is kind of sacrilege. Because armor is just so, uh, well, iron itself is just so rare for us that it, it fe I feel kind of bad just kind of, like, throwing it all away. But I need room. and I have too many pants. I need leggings. Uh, let's see if we can start a little bit. Like so. And that should be. Yes, okay, so I am going to have to throw all these others away, because as of now, iron armor is no longer rare for us. I mean, iron pants are. It's, uh, we only have the chainmail leggings, but it, those are still pretty cool, right? I mean, two four armor, right? That's not that bad. For the leggings, you know? Pretty good. That, that should protect us very good, very good. But, um, right, today... We need to do something. Last episode, when I traded with the piglins, um, we only got one, count it, one piece of obsidian. And we need a lot more if we're going to make an enchanting table. And with the enchanting table, I will finally feel more protected. My gathering and stuff will be more efficient. Um, all right, what's on the to-do list? So we can still do that treasure map. Um, we are going to have to go back into the nether. We do need gunpowder. I don't think we need armor and tools anymore, but we do need the weapon smith. I don't think a villager has claimed this block yet. Um, one of them will eventually, hopefully, because I heard a baby. Uh, all I've done off stream, or off stream, off camera, by the way, is I've just been like farming my farms, my tree farms, my regular farms, my bamboo farms, my sugarcane farm, and I've just been trading massively with these villagers. And you know what? I'm kind of bored of it. I did level up quite a few of them, which I'll show you, but let me just show you this first, right? So I've been trading a lot. Uh, it will keep this one. I have so many arrows. God damn! Those in there. Actually, you know what? I want the full stack. Oh, right. And we, uh, uh, I made the other Fletcher a master, so I was able to get this bow. All I did was I got our original Fletcher's Unbreaking 2 bow and the new Fletcher's Power 2 bow, and I combined them with the anvil down there. So, right, let me just show you guys what I'm talking about so you guys are all caught up. I think I leveled this guy up. Come here. Um, yeah, so I leveled this guy up. Now he buys the kelp blocks. Who else is leveled up? Uh, oh, I can show you guys the... Did that level you up? Oh, I must have also leveled that guy up. Right, so here's the new armorer. Look at that. I got him all the way up to this. So, lava buckets. We could actually do that trade and level him up just to see... Because we could buy a bunch of buckets off of the fishermen, and then we can use the lava buckets and trade with this guy. And, alright, the tool guy is still the same. Uh, he still has the crap tools there. I, he wants me to buy his bell. I don't really want to do that. Leather is still the same. Oh, one more thing. So, for some reason, villagers seem to get stuck in Sour Belts's Sour Belts Clinic. I don't know what it is. Maybe they're really hurt and really in pain and they just stand in here. But it's like they get stuck under this staircase. And then I, I keep losing, not losing, but I keep like misplacing where one of the farmers are. And even the stonemason, he got stuck like right here on the on the fence. I think it's because they're like a little bit too tall and they don't know how to walk around things too well. So they get stuck in there sometimes. Um, which I eventually have to free them because I'm worried they're going to change villager blocks and whatnot. Um, the Fletcher. So I've just been trading with these guys. I've been taking a lot of their crops. They're starting to plant wheat now, which is interesting. Like their crops totally changed from beets to wheat, uh, which is cool. That's cool. 
eventually they'll start planting beets again, I think, because some of them have beet seeds. But, but yeah. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? I think that's it. I think we are all caught up. I showed you guys the librarian before. Yeah, so I guess we're all caught up. So what I want to do right now is I've been thinking, right? We can either go the gunpowder route or I can go back into the nether and look for another temple because we need gold. That is that is what we need. And I could do the treasure map, but we've done so many treasure treasure map episodes that I think I will just do the treasure map off camera cuz it's honestly not that exciting. Unless I find something exciting. So let me just put this here. I don't know why I have a poison potato on me. Uh, I don't even know why I put poison potatoes in here. It's not like I'm going to eat poison potato. Okay, we're all good. We're all good. So, I think what's more interesting is if we... If we explore. I think that's more interesting. So I'm going to try and explore. I mean, I could go in the nether, but God, the nether is so dangerous. I don't know. Hmm. Hey, you know what? Ugh. Oh, man. Ooh, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I think I'm going to go in the nether, though. I think I am. So let's instead go back into the nether. I know we've done two nether episodes in the in the past. The, am I jumping around? The last two episodes were nether episodes. But oh, no, there's no point in going to the nether if I can't get gold, right? But I can't get gold anyways because I can't mine. I really need that obsidian though. That obsidian. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these planks here. Um, I will take another set of planks. Probably going to do some building. Okay. Uh, mm. I am going to need like a flint and steel. Ooh. Uh, you know, I'll take a fire pit with me for when I have to cook food. Damn. Oh, right. We need the gold helmet. So we don't get hacked by those uh, piglins. Okay. All right. Uh, let's let's go to sleep. I don't know. I cause like I was thinking. I was thinking we find a mine shaft, right? And with the mine shaft, we would find gold. Gold and other ores like in those chests. I was thinking maybe I could do that. You know what? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. I'm sorry I didn't plan out like a plan for this episode, but there's just so many things to do and so many wraparound ways to do it. Can I sleep yet? So many wraparound ways to do it in this challenge since i'm not allowing myself to mine it's just like i'm kind of like trying to weigh the pros and cons of doing this and doing that so i am gonna switch back the helmet oh uh, there we go it would be it, probably better to have the protection helmet but whatever uh let's go and ride the let's go ride the mule and what i'm going to do I'm gonna go and look around like just like a cave that opens up or something maybe like a mine shaft I don't know I'm gonna try and go down this way this is the way we came from but I haven't traveled this way like we're gonna be passing our spawn and I haven't gone north a lot I'm gonna see down there yeah, this hole I could have explored this to be honest Hmm. Not too sure, though, because I can't really mine. So what's the point of me going down in there, right? 
We're going to be going north. And hopefully we'll find home again. Uh, right. Crossing. I'm just trying to remember that, like, okay, I crossed a river. That way I don't get lost. Oh, we got some mushrooms here. Actually, I don't have these. Get off. I don't, I don't have any of these. Take some of these. Come here. Uh, you hold on to the mushroom. You know what? You hold on to the campfire. Maybe I could find, like, a spawner, too. That would be nice. That would be very nice if I could just randomly find a spawner. Hmm. That would be sick. Gotta remember that we're just going north. All I have to do to get home is go south. Are you kidding me? Really couldn't get up that, buddy? I think, whoa, man, this biome is pretty crazy. Pretty nuts. I feel like we might find another village here because the found that Taiga village before. This is Taiga biome, I think. Okay, we see a snow mountain. Like, look at this. My gosh. Crazy. If I went north instead, I imagine how different the series would have been. I'm not understanding the mossy cobblestone blocks that's everywhere. I'm really not. Oh, crap. Okay. Try and not kill the mule, which, by the way, still needs a name. You guys haven't named it yet, so he doesn't have a name. Oh, shit. Wait. There we go. Didn't mean to get off you there. Is this like a Taiga mountain? Or like, what is this? Old growth spruce Taiga. No, it's not a spruce Taiga. It's just a big mountain. There's probably like a huge cave system underneath this. Okay, let's go, let's go. This is the adventure, the adventure quest. The quest for adventure. I see a Zombra. Hello, Zombra. Is there anything in there that I need to be worried about? God, you're okay. Holy crap, what is all of that in there? Um, looks cool. Definitely looks cool. What is that block? It's very pale. There's some threats in there which I want to take care of. Donk, or uh, Mule, you stay there. Take care of these fools. I need this guy's gunpowder anyways. Get him. Okay. He's... Oh. Stop right there. Got him. Uh, let me just go get the donkey. The mule. I wanted a donkey. Come back here. We have to go down there. I know, it's scary. But it's that's the part of adventure. Oh, shit. What the hell, you bastard? Oh, I suck at shooting on horseback. Oh my gosh, I suck. Point blank. There we go. Nice. Good. I think I need to eat my healing. The zombie. What is this? Is this called something different? No, it's still a spruce taiga. Oh shit. Oh, I almost killed myself there. Right, burn, zombie, burn. The uh, is get him. Die. What is this? Is this clay? Oh, it's clay. Interesting. The whole clay deposit. What are these plants? Big drip leaf. The hell am I, donkey? 
place looks nuts. I mean, I'll take the clay. We need the clay. Cool. I know where to get clay now. A lot of it, too. Because the uh, stonemason takes the clay. I'm like... They're like the lily pads, but not exactly. Oh, they grow like that. Oh. Whoa, this is nuts. Okay, let's go get the uh, mule before I lose him. Buddy. Have to explore. Adventure awaits. Light up our sides. No. Crazy. What are these? Can I take those? What is that? Low berries. I've never seen this before, by the way. Is this part of the Cajun Cliffs update, or is this just an older update that I still haven't seen yet? I'm very new to it. Like two glow berries. They look like little shiny testicles. Why? These are the moss blocks, aren't they? This. Azalea. Yes, of course, of course. I know what that is. Ouch. 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 If I could just stop killing myself, that would be nice. Do you... Guys, you guys need to stop. Go away. It doesn't seem like he can walk through the azaleas, which is... Oh, I lied. Watch out for this bow. Hell of a lot of clay. Oh! Hey! Stone! Thanks, man. Okay, cool little, like, mindset. Watch out for those, um, travel pieces. Ah, oh, I should have let the, uh, let him over here. Should have let him over here, and he could blow up that iron for us. That would be good. Um. So, can I dig? Flowering Azalea. The hell? What is this place? Nuts! And of course, these are the mossy blocks, right? Moss blocks. It's like a whole underground forest. Uh huh. This. What is that? What are these? I guess I can't pick them up by normal means. Take another one of these flowering things. Uh huh. I guess I would need shears to pick those up. This is crazy. Take some of this clay. Me. Take this clay. Gonna be nighttime. Danger. The waste of wood, but. I'd rather use it than be stuck in that hole. Yes, mule, I know. It is nighttime. Don't worry, I'm not worried, so you should get the place lit up. The fuck was that sound? Did you guys hear that? I heard like a freaking velociraptor. What was that sound? 
It's, it, I, I shit you not, it sounded like a velociraptor. Like, is this area dangerous that I don't know about? I hear skeletons. Off you quick. Monkey. On the mule. Sorry, the mule, not the dog. Oh, it was a baby fox that I heard, wasn't it? That sounded like a velociraptor. I think. It, I think. Got clay for trading. Horse dirt. Dirt. Like, this has to be a different biome in itself, right? What is this called? Lush caves. Oh, lush caves. That's what these are. Lush caves. Ah. Uh... By the way, yeah, it's totally the, uh, the fox that sounds like a velociraptor. Uh, that actually genuinely scared the crap out of me. What the fuck? More of these globes. danger ouch danger's not following me is it ooh what if it's a mob spawner that would be nice hey donkey just be careful buddy we gotta keep our wits about us I'm sorry the mule that was Okay, guys, seriously, the mule needs a name. I can't keep mistakenly calling it Donkey. The mule needs a name. Leave a comment down below on what you want to name it. It could be anything. It could be fucking saggy nipple titties. Whatever you want. Just give him a name. I got iron. Got from that zone. Sound close. Guys sound really close. I'm near a mob spawner because of all this all these sand. No, they're they're above. They're definitely above. Getting out of here. I've explored this enough. Turns out there was nothing much. Put a torch there so I know that I've been here. If I ever see it from far away. These are in my way, man. My way, dude. I'm in full iron armor, right? So creepers shouldn't be able to kill me even if they fell on me. Gosh, look at that. Is that a village over there? That is. That's a village way over there village over there in that mountain. Might go check it out. He might have some stuff in it. That might be a village down there too. No, that looks like more lush caves. Um, an ice biome doesn't sound bad to explore and look at. I'm gonna check up here. See if I was right. Zombie spawner. Regular zombie. Oh. Fuck you, dude. Skeleton. I'm leaving. You guys aren't worth the trouble. Oh, fuck you. Going down. Climb down nice and gentle like. Careful. There we go. So this must be a grown azalea. And if I remember Sour Belt told me to check under them for stuff, but uh, I didn't see any. Ow! Don't kill my donkey, please. Or my mule. Sour belt told me to check. Oh, shit! Uh-oh. Oh, we gotta go. 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 
I don't care where, just go, just... Go, just go, heal up and go. Just up and go. Climb up this. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. I know you're hurt. I didn't bring you any food. That's my bad. Maybe we can get into that village or bed. Quickly, quickly. Good. Okay, we are moderately good. My donkey is not, though. My donkey needs to heal. How long does it take for donkeys to heal? How do I heal my donkey? I didn't bring any wheat or anything. That in there. Ah, oh, I still get this wood on me. Damn. I should have brought a dog with me. Ooh. Scared. Scared to move. God. That was scary. Going. Can't stay here. Gotta get that village right there. We actually made it. Cool. Imagine if I if I went north instead of the way that I went, and I found this village instead of the one that we were at. How much different the series would be. Oh my god, lag. Oh shit. Oh my god, lag. Dude, the lag almost killed me. Fuck off. Your gunpowder. Gunpowder. The lag almost killed me. I got all turned around. Ran into that creeper. Another lush cave. I gotta check those out more. I've never... Nothing. Nice. It's, um... Borrow this bed. There are monsters nearby. I can't rest. Are you kidding me? Where are the monsters? Where did that come from? Oh, you, you bastard. Get fucked. Hey, now can I rest? Thank you. Woo! We are safe. To see what this place has to offer. In fact, it looks up here, horse, donkey, mule. Fuck. Emeralds, okay. Oh, I'll just take what I can. I'll take everything. Fuck it. Hey, the back. Um, got some pumpkins. You guys like to grow pumpkins. They live off of. Live alone, kitty. Oh, sorry, kitty. By yourself. I think I think everyone in here has died. I'm not I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm pretty sure that every villager that was here has died. I don't I don't see any villagers. The village seems abandoned. Eyes. That's weird. A fern? Oh, fuck it. I'll take it. I don't know. Never had a fern before. Uh, ow. And. This place sucks. There's no good loot. You kidding me? Really? And. Not even a villager. Now I gotta find my mule. Oh well, found him. Taking these pumpkins. Good for trading. I don't have to grow my own. There's no villager here, so they're not gonna care. Off we go. Am I still heading north? I am. Oof. Hold on. The villager trail goes way down here. What the fuck? Okay, so they just spawned weird. There's probably more to the village underneath. 
probably where all the villagers are. They're way down there. Ugh. I'm stuck on everything. What is this? Why do you guys only have wood and potatoes? You're such a poor village. Not even worth looting, you guys. <sighs> the depressing village. The depresso village. Has my donkey been healing? Maybe am I supposed to like get off him and then he heals? I don't know how it works. What? Shit, dude, I'm sorry. That's that's what I wanted to not do. What I didn't want to do. Oh my god. Wait. Got you, buddy. There you go. I got you. I got you. You're safe. You're safe. Oh my god, there's up here. God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have my bucket of water. Okay, just... There's the villagers. Okay, I brought the donkey down. Uh, I put my water back. Wait! Why are you up there? Nice. So I'm into the pressing village. Yeah, you guys are you guys are all poor. Get off the donkey and see if he heals up. Oh my gosh, this sucks. Any of these, but I'll take them. Hmm. Boxes. Boxes are cute. I don't know how to get a fuck. Burn. Taking these pumpkins. You. Alright. Got anything in here? No. What a weird ass village. Weird. The way it spawned and everything just doesn't make sense. Okay, so if I'm right in saying this, if I do this, I can tame a fox, right? Oh, they're sleeping under the rain. Whatever, just eat it all. Oh, you're a big boy. Eat it all. I don't, I don't need the inventory. I need the inventory slots more. Um... Keep heading north. Oh, my donkey is so hurt. How do you heal a donkey? Or a mule? Damn it, I keep calling it a donkey. How do you heal a mule? I have to give it wheat, but they're... Oh, there's a house here. Wait, are you... You're a weaponsmith. Bane of Arthropod's sword. Um, I'll just buy some more axes off you, really. Yeah, and here, you can have the potatoes, because I don't want you to starve. And have the bread, too. I don't want you to starve. I want this guy to be safe. But these are jack-o'-lanterns. Alright, I'm going to confine this man. I don't know if I'll ever have a reliable source um a reliable source of axes ever again man.
This this is gonna be my reliable axe guy. Lives in there forever. Mule, where'd you go? You'll go. Crap. Uh go up here. Ow. Oh no. Oh shit. Um uh well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Totally Not Minecraft. I am going to have to go and find my mule. Please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Mule, hello. All right. Subscribe. Bye-bye.